Everyone's wondering if Lenny Kravitz is single, and Gail King is no exception. The CBS Morning's co-host dug into the singer's love life in an interview on Thursday, asking for a friend. Is there love in your life now? King queried. Do you have a significant other in your life, and can I beat her ass if she is? Oops, did I say that out loud? And I'm non-violent, Lenny Kravitz. But do you have a partner? Do you have a love in your life? Kravitz, 59, had a diplomatic response. Right now, I'm just open. Are you even looking? King continued. It's hard not to look, Kravitz responded. You know, when you desire something, you're looking for it, right? But I find that when you don't look is when you find it. And I'm at a place where, I've said this for several years, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I wasn't ready. I thought I was ready. But I can say that I've never felt how I feel now. King, 69, gave the singer another nice compliment before the conclusion of the segment. I'll just say this about you. You seem very comfortable in your own skin at all times. Clearly, King, 69, thinks highly of the flyaway musician. When Lenny Kravitz walks in a room, you are the epitome of cool, you are the epitome of sexiness, she said at the beginning of the interview. And I'm wondering if you are aware of the effect you have on people, or is this something you have to work at? Kravitz answered while maintaining a sense of mystique and humility. I don't work on it at all, and I don't think about it, he said, but I am aware of people's reactions. The rocker sent some positive energy in King's direction as well. After she told him, I feel so happy to be on the planet, Kravitz warmly added, healthy and gorgeous. Elsewhere in the segment, the singer explained how his daughter Zoe Kravitz has helped him combat his people-pleasing tendencies. That's something that I've been exercising and growing in, where no is necessary at times, he said. And this is something that I actually learned from my daughter. She's so good at creating her boundaries. And boundaries are healthy, but that generation, they don't have time to play.